travel with a couple of pets. Two parakeets, pickles and olives. Pickle, pickles and olive. Don't know why one's plural and the other not, but anyway. Pickles and olive. And to be honest with you, I think pickle is the greener one on top and olive is a little more yellow but I don't know that for sure anyway they uh, don't talk I wish they did when I was a kid we had a parakeet that was a real chatterbox and then here's my pal Gizzy and Gizzy made me realize a couple things one, uh, I, I do love having a dog, but Gizzy is Terry's dog. <laughs> and so he pays most of his attention to Terry. And then when Terry goes to sleep, he comes out and spends the rest of the evening uh, by my side. So I get my share of attention from, from Gizzy. And I'm really glad to have him along. Uh, he was a gift from my wife's late sister, I think I've probably mentioned before. So, Gizzy, he's extra special. He's an extra special pug. And he's a lucky pug. And see that lucky number four in his forehead there? <laughs> anyway, I took Gizzy to get him fixed one day which is what you know you should do for dogs and the vet wanted to charge extra money because Gizzy had only one testicle and he was going to have to go do some extra work to find out where the other one resided <laughs> what was going to be a terrible day for Gizzy turned out to be a lucky day he got to keep his <laughs> His one testicle. <laughs> oh, give me, don't you like a treat, buddy? But here, that'll get you a treat. But I realized something about dogs, and I kind of liken it a little bit to when you're a parent and you have a newborn, and they keep you up, you know, they get you up in the middle of the night to feed them. And then eventually, one morning you wake up. There you go, buddy. One morning you wake up and the baby has slept through the night. And it's like, holy cow. You get up and go check and sure enough, the baby's fine. And, and you realize that, uh, you know, maybe those days of, of four in the morning feedings are over and they, and they generally are, right? But in reality, I've always wondered, did the baby sleep through the night? <laughs> or did we sleep through the night? It's kind of six one, half a dozen the other. Uh, but I, I realized something about dogs. So I like to think that, that Gizzy just totally loves me, you know? And, uh, and shares his affection with me and everything because of the way he feels towards me but maybe it's all me you know that he's just a little animal living to survive off of instinct and and not so much emotion for his human partners but i'm pretty sure that uh, that he he does care about us but I do think that uh, some of the reward of having uh, a pet is really comes from your feelings towards them and it's a reflection of you and so I think that's why uh, we get so much more out of having an animal to take care of than uh, we put into it. And, uh, so it's kind of like a self-rewarding thing. But anyway, traveling with, uh, with pets is highly recommended. 
and you know there's just uh, no two ways about the dimension that gives it out. Yeah, as well as pickle and olives. Pickles and olive. <laughs> I'll get that straight one of these days. Anyway, thanks for watching.